Hello, we're back talking about volts, and this one is O for oils, lubricants, and other liquids, Peter. What can you tell us about the, the checking of those liquids on this machine? Yeah, part of your uh, initial visual checks around your bike before you ever go out with it would be to check your oils and lubricants for the, for the levels and leaks. So, engine oil, you'd want to you want to know that you've got um, a full level of oil. There'll be a dipstick or a window, so you've got the, the right amount of oil in your engine. But equally, have you got any leaks? So check around engine, left and right, underneath. Have you got any leaks at all? So um, the next thing would be brake fluid. So they'll always have a, a little window so you can check the level. But equally. Have you got a leak from either of the calipers, front or rear, and also around the master cylinder? You definitely don't want to be riding with a brake fluid leak. Um, the only other thing which I'd include in lubricants is the fuel in the tank. Yeah, if over the winter things can perish, especially if they've been stood for a while, so rubber hoses can perish or split. Um, carburetors, again, standing for a while, they can sometimes um, start to flood. So if you've got any petrol leaks whatsoever, they need to be remedied before you ever go out on the bike. That's lovely. And some of these fluids obviously do degrade over time, don't they? Brake fluid yeah. and, and the engine oil and the, the coolant and the fuel, as we've mentioned, they all degrade and need yeah. changing. So that's something that, that you know, someone needs to be mindful of. When was that brake fluid last changed? M manufacturers generally suggest that the brake fluid should be changed every two years. Now that's whether the bike's in use or even standing. Without getting too technical, that absorbs moisture. So just sitting there in the garage, it's degrading. Um, your fuel can go off these days. The fuels only last six months to a year and sort of just standing there in the tank. So if you're having trouble starting the bike, that might be your issue. So again, that's something that needs to be sorted out. That's lovely, thank you. Thank you very much.